Hi, I'm Rob Reed with Recreation by Design, and I have the opportunity to present to you the Bay Point 747 KBQB. Yes, it's a king bed with quad bunks. Let me show you the outside here. We're gonna start off on the front. We use an 030 metal in the front. We do have everything 16 inch on center, uh, wood, two inch uh, wood stud sidewalls, and same thing with the front end. Here we're offering you 30 pound LP tanks, which are standard. Back here, you're gonna have a battery and a battery disconnect. So if you're plugged in and you could become disconnected, you can hit that battery disconnect and it'll cut off the battery so you don't uh, use your battery as you're storing the unit. Around the side here, we're coming to our first slide out. This is one of our, our front bedroom master bedroom slides. Uh, that houses the king bed. But you'll notice a couple of things. We use thicker metal on the outside and thicker metal here. Uh, you can't hardly push in on that. Um, that way it's nice and solid, gives you a lot of insulation in there, and it's all wood studded in there. One of the neat things that separates us from a lot of our competitors is we use this L bracket here, this metal L bracket, that covers all your raw wood in there. So if you look here, it comes all the way down and around, and then it, the uh, bottom side of the floor is undercoated, just like an undercoating on your car. So that, and it comes out three feet. So that's a great big slide out for you in the master bedroom. One of the neat features are is our 8800 series max airflow windows. Uh, they are 80% tint and they open up 50%. So you get a lot of good airflow and every one of our Bay Point windows opens up to 50%. Now let's come on down the side here. We'll show you a few more features of your Bay Point. Around the opposite end of the slide here, you got your outside shower. Your outside shower has hot and cold running water. It's got a six foot hose on it. So you can clean your fish, clean your kids' feet, clean your feet from fishing, and then it just locks in place. Uh, here we have our 40,000 BTU floor ducted heat furnace. Now this is the outside of your furnace. So it's got your vent here and everything. It's on the off door side. So it's away from all the kids camping because this does get a little bit warm, but that's where your 40,000 BTU furnace is. You got your same slide room windows, same slide out, same uh, L bracket there to close in all of your wood uh, from your floor. As we're moving down here, you can see we got big windows outside here. You got your ABS fender skirt here. Uh, it's all white. Your two-tone metal, uh, two-tone color metal. Back here, you have your termination system. We always put an LED security light above that. So if you're having to mess with your, uh, you know, your sewer dump at, the, at nighttime, you have plenty of light to see that. One of the things I want to point out to you here in our slide out system is our three seal slide system. Now on the outside we have a bulb seal here so your room comes in and compresses on the bulb seal which seals it from the outside. This is a wiper seal so this is going to wipe off all the dust and uh, wa or water that might come into the house so it's squeegeeing it off and right down out onto the ground. Okay, uh, the inside we have the same seal system, a wiper seal on the inside and another bulb seal on the inside as well. Okay, coming to you back here on this side. Now this is our third slide out on this side. So you got your same slide out depth of three feet. You got all your same side walls and everything here. What I want to point out to you here is we have your potable water, which goes into a 50 gallon fresh water tank. Uh, you have your city water here. You have three different places, the one, two, and three, three different places in the kids' bedroom, in the living room, and in the master bedroom to where you have your cable and your satellite prep. That's where you're gonna put your cables in at. We also have 50 amp service standard. So this is a marine grade plug. You can pull it out and disconnect it and just close the lid. Uh, so you have 50 amp service standard here. On the back side, you have your uh, running lights. One of the things I want to point out to you is our roof. Our roof has a five and a half inch wood truss rafters in the top. It does come down on the sides to about two and a half inches and then we fully deck it so you can walk anywhere you want to up there. Uh, we actually double rafter it around your air conditioner so you got two 15,000 BTU ducted roof airs up there and we double stud around it so you're never going to have any air conditioner come down or get loose up there and then we put your rubber roof on top of that so it's a the rubber roof is laid wall to wall end to end and it actually wraps around the end so when you have your your uh, wall line and your roof line, we actually wrap it around the top of that and then screw the rubber in so there's no way water can get in between the two uh, pieces of wall and roof. 
Now coming around this side, we're uh, gonna have your another slide out room here. This was where your double bunks are. And then you, outside here, you have your crank down stabilizer jacks. Uh, one of the things I wanna point out to you here, let's go on this side real quick, is we'll get a feature shot of this, but we use a 12 inch I-beam frame. So it's a steel I-beam frame that we use. On top of that, we stick a two by four tongue and groove plywood floor. A lot of our competitors only use a two by three OSB floor. So ours is a much stronger floor we feel because that's the same way you're gonna build a floor in your house, a two by four uh, or a tongue and groove plywood floor. Uh, then we also put R7 fiberglass insulation in there and then we wrap it with an R38 blanket wrap. So you have a lot of insulation on the floor and the same insulation goes in on the top in your roof area there okay now moving down we're giving you uh, two 7,000 pound axles here standard uh, they do come with radial tires uh, steel wheels outside here you have your outside water access this is a Richmond residential 20 gallon hot water heater that's standard on the Bay Point folks that gives you ample hot water it's easy to maintain you got your shutoff valves here you can bypass it when you want to winterize the unit very easy and gives you a lot of hot water here in the Bay Point you got your quad steps here easy to get in you have your big grab handle if you decide you want to build a deck on these steps just fold right in stow away that way you can build a deck right over the top of that and then you got a five foot thermal pane patio door you'll notice inside the patio door you have your uh, your drapes in there here you have exterior marine grade speakers so you can have your your awning is right here folks and you got an outside 110 outlet here your awning is a power awning uh, and it's also got an LED light strip on it Hey folks, now we're inside the Bay Point 747 KBQB, and here we're gonna focus on our entertainment center. You can get a 75 inch TV in here. You have all your satellite ready and cable ready plugs here. Uh, on this side, you have your command center, so you can turn your porch light on, you can put your slide out rooms out, see what your tank sizes are. Down below here, we have our uh, DVD player. Uh, it is built right in, so it'll play the DVD through your TV. It's also got a USB port and your, all your stereo functions. You got an A, B, and C uh, stereo speaker system, so you can play all of it. A is bedroom, uh, B is the living room, and C is outside. You have your 4500 BTU uh, fireplace here. This is an all-electric fireplace, but it does have four different color uh, stone colors and flame colors and it'll also kick out heat. So it'll kick out 4,500 BTUs of heat. You notice how we got storage on either side to put your extra DVD or CD players in here. Then you're gonna move right over here to our uh, tri-fold sofa. Our tri-fold sofa is a 72 inch. It is a queen size bed inside there. You have your nice wood valances above here. You got your nightshades for uh, privacy at night. We'll move over here to the uh, dinette table. Uh, one thing I did miss, I want to point out to you here, is your USB ports. Those are two, uh, or you get two double USB ports in there. So you can be playing your iPhone or charging your iPhone while you're sitting there at the, at the sofa. You also have a table and four chairs here. One of the other neat things on our table and four chair dinette here is it is have uh, storage in each of your chairs. All four chairs have storage that you can put uh, placemats, magazines, kids games, that sort of thing in here. So it's, it makes uh, for a nice storage area to go along with your uh, wood top table there. On the side here, you also have uh, outlet switches. And up here you have an abundance of storage. Uh, Bay Point is known for all the storage that we have here. So every square inch we have some storage doors and uh, overhead cabinets and lots of drawers in here. Now folks, we're gonna move into the kitchen of the Bay Point 747 KBQB. That does stand for king bed in the front, quad bunks in the rear, and we'll get to that in just a little bit. I wanna show you this very expansive kitchen here. This kitchen gives you a lot of area to cook to clean and to, to prep and also to, to microwave stuff. So one of the neat features we have here is our sink cover. It is a roll up magnetic sink cover here. And then it gives way to your uh, full basin stainless steel sinks. You can get full size plates in here to wash them. 
Also another neat thing, a part of this is our upgraded pull-out sprayer. This gives you uh, lots of opportunity to, to wash your dishes and rinse them off and, and get them stacked in there so your husband can put them away. You have lots of counter space here. You have nice storage underneath your cabinet. You have three big drawers of storage. I'm just pulling out the middle one there. So you got three drawers there. You got two more over there. Your overhead cabinets, again, are a lot. You can get nice cereal boxes in there. Uh, all of your canned goods and stuff can go in here. And then you have a residential cooking area. So we give you a 30 inch residential microwave oven overhead. And then this is a type of stove you're gonna have at home. This is a five burner. A 30 inch residential range. It's also got your digital backboard here. So this is just like a range you're gonna put in your house, only you have it in your destination uh, trailer by Bay Point. Here you have your pantry, so you got more storage here. Uh, you know, you got three pantry shelves, you got two more drawers down there. One of the neat things we have here is our refrigerator. This is a residential style refrigerator, and it is a four door stainless steel. This is an optional refrigerator for us. You can see how it opens up nice and big. You got a crisper, and then you also have a freezer down below. So this is a, a, another refrigerator just like you'd have at your house. Hi folks, coming into the kids area, we got quad bunks back here and they're opposing slides. So once we get going here, we'll show you just how much floor space you're gonna have for your kids to actually camp back here and stay out of each other's way. One of the neat features I wanna show you, this is a bath and a half destination trailer. So their kids, your kids have your own bathroom back here, so they don't need to go up and bother mom and dad up in their bathroom. They got a porcelain toilet here with a foot flush and back over here, you're gonna have your sink. And then you got a medicine cabinet above there. So you're going to notice that we have huge bunks here. These are 32 by 72 bunks. One of the neat features that we do here at Bay Point is you'll see some of our competitors give you a four inch foam mat for the kids' bed matting. Ours is actually an inner spring mattress, just like mom and dad are going to have in their king bed up front. But the kids now have it in their, in their bunks. So you get four bunk beds here with inner spring mattresses. You got a 300 pound weight limit here on the top of this one. Down below you have your same uh, 32 by 72 bed. We give you a ladder. We also give you a trundle bed. And so you can actually get six kids sleeping back here. That is an option in the Bay Point 747 KBQB. Back over here we give you two huge shirt closets for the kids. You got a shirt closet on the left with two drawers down below. And notice down below you have seven drawers all together here. You have a, a overhead storage here as well. And on this other side you have another shirt closet. What's really neat is right here in the middle, we give you a, an area for your TV for the kids. You can either wall mount it or you can put it on the counter, but you can get a 32 inch TV back here. So if they're playing Xbox or GameCube or something like that, They've got areas to do that back here and keep away from mom and dad up front camping. On the other side here, again, these are opposing slide bunk areas here. So I have the same size beds on this side. Bed up top, bed in the middle, and then a trundle bed down below. What I don't know if you can focus in on is you got a light and dual USB ports at the head of every bed except for the trundle bed. So four out of the six kids that can sleep back here will have a light and dual USB port so they can play their iPhones or iPads or whatever. Hey folks, now we're in the master bathroom up front by mom and dad's king bed, bedroom area. Here I'm gonna show you that we have a stackable uh, a linen closet, but this also doubles as your washer and dryer prep. So you can move out these uh, removable shelves and actually put a full size front load washer and dryer in here. That is an option. We're not showing it in this one, but I wanted you to be able to see how much storage you're going to have in here if you don't have the washer and dryer. You got doors that close it off. One of the neat things that Bay Point's known for is our huge bathroom areas. I'm 6'2", 250 pounds, and I am plenty of room here in the bathroom. Our tub shower, garden showers are huge. They're all fiberglass. So it's not a two piece plastic like a lot of our competitors use out there. This is a one piece fiberglass with a seat in it. We also give you the upgraded faucets and upgraded shower heads. Our toilet is a foot flush and it is a porcelain toilet as well. Our big sink, this is a porcelain sink. It's not a plastic little bowl 
that a lot of our competitors put. This is a regular residential faucet and a porcelain bathroom sink. We also give you dual medicine cabinets. So you have two mirrors and two medicine cabinets on either end, one above the toilet and one above the sink. What I'd like to point out here is our dual control fan. Our dual control fan has got a switch down here on the wall so you can raise and lower your fan lid and also turn on the fan so it'll pull out all the steam that you would have as you're taking a shower. Now we're in the master bedroom with a Bay Point 747 KB QB. This is featuring a king bed slide out up here in the front bedroom. Uh, what I also want to point out to you real quick, here's your digital thermostat. That runs our 15,000 BTU ducted roof air. It's also got a 5600 uh, BTU heat strip in it. So your air conditioner will funnel AC down the ductwork and also the heat if you just needed to run it on electric. Your king bed here is a 70 by 80 king bed. It has a pillow top inner spring mattress standard here. We also have a full uh, storage compartment unit underneath. Uh, we got struts to hold it up. So you got a lot of area there where you can store your second bed linens and the sweaters and stuff you don't use as often. On uh, either side of your bed, you have dual USB ports. So you can use your iPhone, your iPad. Um, you have your night lights there above, and then you also above there have uh, overhead storage. Behind us here, you have your big uh, walk-in closet. You got four drawers below it, and then you have lots of hanging closet with a uh, four-door mirrored closet there for you. Over here, we have your uh, six or four dresser drawer. You can have your 32-inch TV sit on that. And that is it for the Bay Point 747 KBQB. I thank you for watching the video. For further information, you can call Rob Reed at 574-326-3307, or you can email me at Rob, R-O-B as in boy, at rbdrv.com.